Good morning, folks. We've got a couple solid links today. Bepi Colombo's at Mercury, a strange star is defying explanation, and we've got a Tier 1 update on the geomagnetic excursion science. We'll check out the tropics, and of course, we're starting with the last 24 hours on our star. Midday yesterday, the flaring just stopped. It never reached much higher and didn't release any CMEs towards the Earth, and now the flaring's gone altogether. We do have sunspots and plasma filaments, but all are quiet in the potential eruptive zones. Quick look here at the sunspots, slight decay in the active regions, and they are turning through. We will keep watching, but calm is expected today. Up next, we're in the South Indian Ocean. Major cyclone charging west towards Madagascar and Africa. It's going to make quite an impact after having developed to become vastly stronger than it was forecast two or three days ago. Prayers for the locals. It's going to be bad where it hits. First up in the articles is this. Bepi Colombo in for one of the last flybys before official orbital insertion. A reminder, this is the most important planetary mission of the decade as it's finally set to tell us if Mercury's magnetic field is changing like the other spheres in our solar system. Up next, we're finding a star that just stopped pulsating. This is as weird as it is unexplained. They have pretty good records of stars, especially pulsating stars, and they don't just all of a sudden change. That not changing all of a sudden actually goes for most stars, at least until they nova, but this was different. Just imagine a lifelong beard guy just deciding to shave one day for no reason. Interesting. Last but not least, our top story confirms that the Earth's magnetic field plays a role in the length of day, the rotation rate of the Earth. For those newer here, we have been tracking a record speed up in the rotation speed of our planet, dropping the official length of day by a tiny bit. We have also been saying the magnetic field changes ongoing right now are to blame, and it looks like there's one more point for that theory here. Folks, big event coming up on Saturday at Observer Ranch. Our first special guest speaker would be a great weekend to come on out to the ranch, and we would love to see you. ObserverRanch.com We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 7 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.